Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. On March 1, 2024, the Russian Ministry of Defense unveiled footage showcasing a test of the RS-24 Yars Intercontinental Ballistic Missile, ICBM, conducted to evaluate its capabilities, including its capacity to carry multiple nuclear warheads. This release closely followed Russian President Vladimir Putin's address to the Federal Assembly on February 29, during which he asserted that Russia's strategic nuclear forces are fully operational. According to the Russian Defense Ministry, the missile test occurred at the Plisetsk State Test Site in northern Russia. The Yars missile, renowned for its ability to carry multiple nuclear warheads and typically equipped with a multiple independently targetable re-entry vehicle, MIRV, reportedly struck its target successfully on the Kamchatka Peninsula. Emphasizing its range of over 10,000 kilometers, the ministry underscored its pivotal role as a cornerstone of Russia's nuclear arsenal. This announcement followed discussions in the West regarding the potential involvement of NATO troops in Ukraine, a topic addressed by leaders such as French President Emmanuel Macron. The Institute for the Study of War, ISW, views these developments as part of Russia's strategy to employ nuclear threats to influence Western perceptions and diminish support for Ukraine by insinuating that NATO actions could escalate into a nuclear conflict. However, the U.S. think tank also highlights the improbability of Russia actually utilizing nuclear weapons in Ukraine or elsewhere, as assessed by military analysts. The RS-24 Yars, an intercontinental ballistic missile, ICBM, operated by Russia's strategic missile forces, is distinguished by its extensive operational range, capable of targeting objectives up to 12,000 kilometers away. This attribute positions the RS-24 Yars as one of the longest-range missiles globally, affording Russia the ability to project its strategic capabilities across vast distances. Equipped with a multiple independently targetable re-entry vehicle, MIRV, system, the RS-24 Yars can carry multiple nuclear warheads, each capable of striking distinct targets autonomously. Its capacity to accommodate four to six nuclear warheads enhances its strategic deterrence potential. The integration of the MIRV system with the missile's extensive range and countermeasures against missile defense systems further enhances its strategic value. Designed to succeed older systems such as the Topol and Topol-M, the RS-24 Yars is deployed in both mobile and silo-based configurations, enhancing the flexibility and reliability of Russia's nuclear deterrent capabilities. In addition to the RS-24 Yars, Russia is preparing for the deployment of RS-28 Sarmat ICBMs, intended to replace the RS-20 volts Voivoda ICBMs, known as SS-18 Satan in NATO terminology. The first regiment equipped with the RS-28 Sarmat is anticipated to be stationed in the Krasnoyarsk territory, further bolstering Russia's strategic deterrent capabilities. That's all for now. See you later.